Hey everybody, I want to talk to you today about Facebook. And when I when I say Facebook, I, it can, this applies to all social media, YouTube or Twitter, anything. You know, I think it can be used as a, a good tool for the modern day Christian. And I think more times and more often than not, it's used for the enemy. And I just want people to think about what they're saying and what they're posting. And, and I may be guilty of it sometimes myself because nobody's perfect. That's, you know, it's a great thing about redemption. You don't have to be perfect. But just, you might know somebody from back in the day. You might know one from yesterday. But when you look at somebody, look at who they are today. Don't look at their past. And try not to be judgmental. Now, I welcome you. As a Christian, I welcome you to judge me. Because people love to say, you can't judge me. Only one, only God can judge me. Well, I welcome all sanctified Christians to judge me. And if you see that I'm doing wrong, feel free to let me know I'm doing wrong. But do it in a tactful manner. Don't, don't do it on social media. Come to me in person or in private. Whether it be, even when you use social media, use a private message. Don't... Don't, don't put it out there for everybody because sometimes you may find out you don't even know the full story or know what's going on. So, like I said, I'm welcome for you to judge me. As a Christian, if you know somebody that you're pretty sure they're not saved, don't judge them. The Lord's going to judge them and He is the only one that can judge them. And if you're not saved, I'm not, even, I'm not worried about you judging. I'm worried about your soul. I pray to God finds his way into your heart that you that you have somebody in your life just working on you just helping get the word to you so so that you can can find Christ but that's, that's what I want to talk about today it's on my heart and it's been on my heart I keep seeing it every day on Facebook and sometimes I keep thinking about doing away with Facebook and YouTube but I think like I say I think it's a good tool for a modern day Christian there need to be more of us on there doing stuff that, I mean, people need to, need to see, see that, you know, they need to see the other side, the good side, it's, cause the enemy sure you, and I can tell you that, there's not a day goes by, not one glance at Facebook, you don't see the enemy on there, anywhere in this world, just walk around, look around, and you'll, you'll see his work, but you also see God's work, let God work through you, don't work against him, don't let, don't let the enemy have that over you, but remember that, don't, Watch how you judge people. Watch how you, the things you say, they can be hurtful. And when somebody else does something you don't agree with it, a rebuttal is not always the best thing. Because a lot of times, people with good intentions, they mess that all up when they go re re doing that on Facebook. Sometimes it's just better to let sleeping dogs lie. Just, you know, you can't say nothing good, don't say nothing at all. Just let it, let it, let it ride, you know? <laughs> Bite your tongue, as mama used to tell me, don't, don't fall for it. That's what they want you to do. Well, I hope everybody has a great day, and God bless.